A man is currently recovering after being shot in a Dothan backyard. Police rushed to the crime scene after getting a call about shots being fired. When they arrived, they found the victim with a gunshot wound, and now police are looking for the suspect. It happened in the 1700 block of South St. Andrews on the south side of Dothan. WDHN's Christian Jones is at South St. Andrews with more. A suspect is on the run, and Dothan police are on the hunt after an early morning shooting. On Tuesday morning, the Dothan Police Department responded to a call of a man shot on the 1700 block of South St. Andrew Street. After arriving on the scene, officers discovered the victim in a backyard suffering from a single gunshot wound. According to Dothan Police Lieutenant Scott Owens, the victim was shot in his lower body. Uh, somewhere around the leg. I'm not quite sure about where the injury is. The victim was then taken to a nearby hospital to be treated for his injuries. Police say the suspect fled the crime scene and is still on the run. Because of this, Dothan Prep Academy was placed on a soft lockdown, but it was lifted shortly after. According to Owens, the suspect and the victim previously knew each other, but police are not sure about the extent of the relationship. But one neighbor says he was told otherwise. I asked him, you know, who shot him? He said he didn't know. Next door neighbor Jimmy Nelson says that he was at his mother's house at the time of the shooting when he heard his mother's back gate making noises. He went to the backyard and that's when he discovered the victim. According to Nelson, it's a good thing that he found the man or else this situation could have gotten worse. He was laying on the ground, you know, so I ran over there when I jumped the fence. I seen a little blood, so I realized that he did, he had been shot. Couldn't have ran too far, you know, from being being shot where he was shot at because his whole hip looked like it was out of place. According to the neighbor, the victim frequently visited the home where the shooting took place, but Nelson says that he's never noticed any prior problems. Despite the shooter still being on the run, Nelson says that he wanted to make sure the victim was safe, even if it meant putting his own safety at risk. I did what I was raised to do, you know, even though, yes, he was in my mother's backyard, Hopped the fence. I mean, he needed some help. I would want somebody to help me. While the suspect has not been found, Lieutenant Owens did say the shooter is looking at a first degree assault charge at the very least. In Dothan, Christian Jones, WDHN News for the Wiregrass.